Sean and Jim here with Barrel Toyota. And today we're going to talk to you a little bit about cabin air filters and the importance of changing your cabin air filter regularly. Uh, Jim is going to remove the cabin air filter from the vehicle so we can take a look at it. You can do that. Thank you, Jim. And uh, while he's doing that, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about uh, cabin air filters and the importance. So most people call the cabin air filter in the vehicle the air that you breathe filter. So, um, so because that's the case, we can compare it with uh, the filter in your home. So what I've done is I went to the local Home Depot and, and picked up a, a couple of uh, cabin air filters uh, or furnace filters. And uh, so as you can see, these, I picked up a filtry, the high allergen, I paid about $18 for it. So most of us will buy this at, at Home Depot. It picks up all the dust and pollen. And I also picked up a, a $3 filter, which uh, just filters the basics only. So there's the difference between the two filters you can buy at Home Depot. Uh, much the same when you buy a filter at your Toyota dealer. Uh, the, the filter that you buy at Toyota um, filters down to a few microns, a uh, very small amount. Dust and pollen particles are very small, so uh, we want to make sure we capture all those so you're not breathing them in the vehicle. And uh, Jim has the filter removed from the vehicle, so we'll take a look at that in comparison. So, yeah, huge difference there. So, obviously, we're going to replace this filter with a new one. Thank you, Jim. And uh, the uh, important thing is, is that we change this about every three to six months. Uh, most people get their oil changed uh, every three to six months. So we can check your cabin filter or replace it every three to six months to keep the uh, inside of the car smelling fresh and keep those dust and uh, uh, allergen particles out of the vehicle. 